In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm saved. I'm saved. I'm delivered. I'm delivered. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For my freedom. For my freedom. For my deliverance. For my deliverance. For my salvation. For my salvation. I'm free. I'm free. Because of Jesus. Because of Jesus. Who is my Savior. Who is my Savior. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. Thank you that you allow me to be your daughter. Thank you that you allow me to be your daughter. Thank you, Lord. Fire in the Holy Spirit. Right. Touch it. Fresh anointing. That's the fresh anointing. Amen. This is my wife. And your wife? <laughs> oh, I don't know that. Who is this to you, sir? So she married two people. <laughs> you know that? You're surprised? No, listen, this is spirit inside, okay? What you did to her? Huh? What Stop! You did? Yes, what you did to her? Murder. Hmm. Who is this man? I don't know. She don't know you, I'm sorry. You came together? Yeah. You live in the same house? She don't know you. Who will see? Huh. Come here. I want to talk to your no. husband. No. Yes. No. Come nice, okay? <laughs> no. Okay. So who is this man over there? Go on to him, eh? Yeah. You know. In the mighty name of Jesus. Sit down a little because the demon is left now. Praise the Lord. Um, I came here to this great ministry because there has been a lot of um, spiritual attacks. I've uh, been well aware of our spiritual husband. Uh, for two and a half years. I've tried gone through other deliverance, uh, but no one ever addressed that um, situation. Um, also, I believe um, their, the spiritual husband wanted to kill me, well, only because of the car accidents I've been in. I've been in other um, several injuries, and my life had come to a, um, a delay. I'm gonna say a stall and a delay. The attacks increased when my mother-in-law passed um, and say that I did receive deliverance today. Uh, it's been glorious. Um, I give grace and honor to the Lord Jesus Christ, who is the deliverer. Um, I bless his name and I thank your ministry for what you also have done for me and my husband today. Um, my husband is a great man of God and I um, I am blessed so much to have him and that he brought me here on um, a spare notice. We drove all the way from Illinois, so I bless the Lord today for my deliverance. How do you feel now? Um, I feel lighter. I feel lighter um, there ever since I uh, was attacked spiritually. Um, two and a half years ago, I felt a heaviness um, and I, I feel much lighter now. And mm -hmm. I'm, I feel like there's some restoration um, spiritually in other areas of my life. I, I already know it is definitely marriage. Amen. Amen. And we glorify God for this great deliverance and we pray as a body to strengthen you and so that you can continue to walk in this excellent freedom. In Jesus' mighty name. In amen. Jesus' name. Fire! Fire! Come on, demons from the past. In Jesus' name. Out! Fire in the Holy Spirit! Fire! Out! In Jesus' name. Amen. Demons worry. Uh, no, after coming from the Cayman Islands yesterday night, no, uh, yeah, yes, day before yesterday, I had uh, some something came in my dream. I had sex in my dream. 
and I was born. Uh, who, who is who? Is, where is your my wife? wife was there. Come, wife only. And we both are Catholics. She and never mind if you are Catholic. Pray for them, you know. Yeah. And, uh, it's not big deal if you are Catholic. It depends on the position of your heart. If yeah. you love Jesus, you're gonna receive. Okay. All people who came from this island receive. I mean, yeah. that's the demons want to confuse you. I know, and I want to confess I was a drug addict for the past 18 years. That's a problem. And I gave up drugs three months back. I got to know Christ, and since that I'm clean. And I came here to. Uh, I got to know Christ, and I I'm a Christian now, but she is still a Catholic, so she still go to the. Catholic Church, and I, I want. I'm a born again now in my spirit, but uh, the rest is on my family. Listen, I was Orthodox. One day I worship God, according to their behavior, and I feel somebody tells me, "Go outside and pray for me, and you will find me." I'm not in this worship. I escape. I love them. I become born again, I'm a minister, and then the Lord after years tells me, go back and help them. Do you understand me? Mm -hmm. They need help. It's not matter what level you find yourself in. <coughs> There's always another level, another level of Christianity. You understand me? Mm -hmm. That's it. Go in another level. Pray, increase your, your prayers and say, Lord, teach me your way. Okay. I want to be more in you, but to be more in you, if you stay in the same church, God can baptize you with the Holy Spirit. No, none of them, uh, you know, pray by the Spirit. Here, some people, they have anointing prayer tongues, you know? You understand me? Yes. So increase your faith, okay? okay. You're going to receive blessings, okay? You're a good man. Stand on your feet. Because your family needs you. I always eat it in dreams, always having an affair. You don't have husband? I am married. You are married? Yes. Such a horrible experience. I just don't want to have those dreams anymore. Touch your head. In Jesus' name. Come here. You want to receive a real anointing now. Okay? Thank you. Eh? Thank you. Are you ready? Yes. <laughs> I mean, listen. Sometimes do not believe every person, okay? You are a good person. Sometimes people around you using you. Stop to be a victim. Be a woman of God. You are a good girl. Okay? What is your request today? I want deliverance for my entire family. God should open up my life. He delivers you already, down. Yes. I want to be a I, I, If Jesus was not here, you will never be delivered. Yes. You are free because of your tears. Thank you. Your heart is pure. Yes. Okay? Thank you.